Hello, hello, and welcome back to Ganesha's Real Channel. So, in today's video, we are going to discuss about Euler's modified method. That means Rani Kutta method of second order. So that means if you are given with an ordinary differential equation in the form of dy by dx, and you need to find out particular value of y for given value of x, then how you can solve it using numerical integration analysis. Okay. Let's see this with an example. So here, dy by dx is given to you. You already know because of my previous videos, if you have watched them already, that this is the form of fxy. It is already given to you. Now, at x0, y is 1. And you need to find out y for x as 0 0.02, 0 0.04 by Euler's modified method. Remember, modified Euler's method and Euler's modified method are two different methods. Okay, so here the formula which you need to remember is first of all you need to find out the basic n plus one, which we can mark as uh, mark as with asterisk y n plus one asterisk, or you can say star, which will be y n plus h f x n y n. It is as similar as Euler method. Correct. Then, when you modify this into Euler's modified method, then you need to find out y n plus 1 without express, y n plus h by 2, f x n y n plus f x n plus 1, y n plus 1 express. That means you need to put this value into here, into this form. Okay, so let's see how it works. You are given with one thing. You need to find out, I mean, fxy is given and you need to find out these values. So it is very, very clear that if you see what is your h, here it is 0, your x, the values of x, your x0 is 0, your x1 is 0 0.02, your x2 is 0.04 simultaneously or corresponding values of y are y naught is if x is 0 y is 1 if x is 0 0.02 you need to find out y1 and y2 but because we are doing Euler's method so initially we have to find out y star 1 and then y1 right so y1 asterisk y2 asterisk when these value will be there, then uh, through modified value, you will find these two. Correct? So let's begin with uh, the formula, which is this. First of all, y n plus 1, it is clearly given to you. Let me change the pen. Okay. So for y1 stress, you can clearly see that n needs to be 0. Correct? So if you put n as 0, your y 0 plus 1 that means y 1 will be here y 0 plus h okay let me talk about h so you can see the difference between every x value is what 0 0.04 minus 0 0.02 is 0 0.02 then 0 0.02 minus 0 is 0 0.02 so your h is 0 0.02 right so y naught plus 0 0.02 f x naught y not because n is 0 here. So, this will be your what? y asterisk. So, y1 asterisk is y not which is given to you as 1 plus 0 0.02. You can see here if fxy then x square plus y. So, x not y not will be x not square plus y not. Correct? So, this gives you 1 plus 0 0.02 your x0 square, x0 is 0, so 0 square is 0, and y0 is 1, so it is 1.02, right? So this value is 1.02. Now, in order to find out y1, need to use this modified form. So y1 will be, n is already seen, 0, you have already taken, y0 plus h by 2, h is 0 0.02 by 2, f x n y n 
so that means f x naught y naught we have already found out the value of here x naught y naught which is 1 plus f x n plus 1 f x n plus 1 means if you put n as 0 x 1 and here if you put n as 0 y 1 x plus 1 correct so y 1 will be y naught which is 1 plus this will be cancelled 0 0.0 1 then 1 plus if you substitute here this form x square plus y x1 square plus y1 s plus correct so this will form 1 plus x1 square that means 0 0.02 square that means 0 0.004 and y1 s plus is 1.02 so if you solve this it will provide you the value of y1 which is 1.020204 you can take up to four decimal places so your y1 is 1.0202 okay then for if you want to find out again another value y2 that will make as make it as so now you have to substitute sorry with me let me change the pen Okay, if you put n as 1, so now y 0 plus, I mean n is, you are substituting as 1, so y 1 plus 1, that means y 2 will be y 1, here you are using this formula, y 1, h, f, x 1, y 1, correct, so y 1 is what? 1.02 so you are taking y1 this value 1.020204 or only 1.0202 plus h is what 0.02 x1 y1 if you expand it x1 square plus y1 right so 1.020204 plus 0.02 x1 square will be 0 0.02 square that means 0 0.004 0 0.004 right 3 zero should be here. similarly here correct so 1 2 3 4 yeah plus y1 which is what 1.0202 correct 0 4 as well if you are taking here you need to put same values so if you solve it your y2 s frisk because this formula is for s frisk y2 star or s frisk will be 1.04061608 okay so you can simply put as 1.0406 then you need to find out the value of y2 using this formula which will be you need to put n as this only so y 1 okay plus up to this it is same just h by 2 is there so h by 2 that means 0 0.02 by 2 f x n y n you have already solved here correct whatever your value is that means x1 square plus y1 plus this is what f x n plus 1 if you put n as 1 so x 1 plus 1 2 so f x 2 plus y2 star correct so you already have got uh, your value if you see this is in comma form when you expand it in this form it will form x2 square plus y2 correct so x2 this is asterisk remember x2 is already given to you 0 0.04 square you will substitute y2 star you have already found out 1.0406 if you add them up and add this with this form multiply with this 0 0.01 if you divide with this and add this with y1 which is 1.0202 then you will get your y2 as 1.0408 Try it out and if you feel any difficulty don't uh, don't forget to comment 
and we'll shortly get back to you. If you like this video, then don't forget to like, share and subscribe my channel. Till my next video, take care of yourself. Bye-bye.